Hi there, I'm Daniel Seberg at the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, and I'm joined right now by Tim Sheridan from Mattel. Uh, Tim, this is some pretty fascinating technology. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's almost mind over matter in some ways. In an almost every way, okay. actually. <laughs> it's called the Mind Flex. Yeah. Now, it's designed to use your brain waves to control the game? Tell me how this works. Exactly. The object of the game is to move a ball through an obstacle course. And you do that uh, not like I just did with my hand, but uh, using the power of your mind. And that's where this headset comes in. This has three different sensors on it. I'm going to go ahead and put it on. Okay. One sensor goes against your forehead and two uh, clip onto your earlobes like this. Now what this is going to do is it's going to read my level of concentration. Okay. And that's what's going to impact the game. Now so we we'll need to tell people a few more things here. Like there's sure. a little, there's a fan in here, right? That's going to be powered right. by your brain waves. Right. I, I'm not a magician. I can't actually levitate the ball. As much as you would like exactly. to. Exactly. Right. But uh, what I can do is, with my mind, control the speed of a little fan that's underneath uh, the ball in the unit there. And uh, the, the more I focus, the more I concentrate, already it's already going. starting, yeah. uh, uh, the higher the ball is going to go, the faster that fan is going to go. Okay. And then you're going to be turning, well, you can turn this knob to get that other axis of it going around. Exactly. Okay. I'm going to exactly. let you demonstrated here. Okay, excellent. So let's, let's go ahead and start a from a resting position. And you can, um, you can customize this obstacle course, we should tell people, right? Absolutely. It doesn't have to stay like yeah. that. Yeah, it's going to come with a, a bunch of different obstacles and you can customize hundreds of different ways to, uh, to move through the course. Now I'm focusing, I'm concentrating, I'm talking to you, yes, but right. I'm still able to focus. That's that's a, does, it's a, it's a neat trick. Does practice make perfect with this? I mean, if you keep it does. doing it, it's It easier. does. It's not immediately intuitive because what you're doing is you're teaching yourself something brand new. You're teaching yourself how to move an object with your mind. I think um, you told me it was like mind eye coordination. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not like hand eye coordination. It's mind eye coordination, which, you know, you've never never had before. Right. Um, as you can see right now, my focus level is nil. I'm not focusing at all while I'm talking to you, which may or may not be a good thing. <laughs> right. But you saw that the ball fell uh, to the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and, and see if I can bring it back down again. Here we okay, go. Ready? Yeah. Wow. There we go. No strings attached. That's right. All right, Tim Sheridan from Mattel, thank you so much. Thanks, Dave. That's another Ion Technology for CBSNews.com.